Welcome to the Cloud Data Channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to install the IntelliJ IDA uh, on Ubuntu 18.04 and you can also install in Debian and Linux Mint. So, this uh, requirement is there for login normal root account. You need to have the user and OS 64 bit RAM and recommend this 4 GB or 8 GB is enough. Hard disk space is showing be. 1.5 GB or 5 GB is enough. At least 1 GB should be have for catches and the screen resolutions and download size for this one it will take. So officially website for IntelliJ is this one is there and you can visit and for the toolbox you can check this one also. Okay. So we have three methods of here additions for this uh, IntelliJ. So one is a community, the second one is ultimate, the third one is educational purpose. This one is free, this one is paid. And this one is for student purpose uses okay so the we have methods three methods for the installation this one the first method the second method and the third one method is this for the installations so i will show you the first method only for second method you can try on it your own purpose after the download this one completed no so it's latest version only when you open this website jetbrands there you can find this about the versions and the download link also you can check there so this is the latest version only I have added and uh, you after the download completed you need to register into the IntelliJ and this is officially package from the standard installation method procedure is there for this one downloading and you have to have a Java also compulsory for the installation JDK okay so um, right now in my previously video you in, in that means uh, in my channel you can find how to install Java also okay so let's begin with the first one here is that method one installing through this snap and this is for the community additions you can just copy and install this command okay let's begin that one i have already updated here so i am not updating i'm skipping that one updating you need to update your first you need to type sudo apt update okay so i have already to update here and it's may and also remember it may takes a lot lots of time to complete the installation okay so that means the downloading size which i've already told us 744 mb so it's depend upon internet it may take how much the size for educational purpose you can see either for ultimate you can see this one uh, ultimate this one okay you can co copy this command and you can install it. it's only 30 days free after installation i need to type in the terminal to verify it okay so in place of community you can give educational and uh, ultimate also and uh, there is also one more method is there one more to install from the ubuntu software center so this is my ubuntu software center is there just you need to type IntelliJ idea here and you can see the community ultimate education is there click on your addition which we want to click install just click on there and install it okay so in this way also it work like this only and uh, after that uh, method 2 which i have already told you like if you want to look for the version which you need to just go to this website okay then uh, open the website here this one copy there you will need to click on download or the option will become so once you click there you will be find the version also there so you can go ahead and you can change the path where you want to install okay change the path here also you need to assign the path also okay after the extracting will use that so that's completed from the toolbox for the like uh, officially a standard installation purpose also same method is that just you need to change the path and go ahead okay so if any error get you can email me an it plotnet at the gmail.com or below to my video so you can email me okay so like i said it's been taking time also to complete the installations depend upon internet once that is completed i will show you the remaining step of all about that one so as you can see this installation is completed so let's type ls to check the way it is not showing okay so now i'm going to ignore that one so let's have a copy this command uh, press oh that's not a community edition is now available and snap in and oh, over inside that one is available so we need to go to that path cd snap in let me check why it's well i will 
will ignore this one. Let's check here from the terminal we are showing on our here you can see IntelliJ is showing up. Oh, I have clicked on that one. That's why we waited for that one to come up here on screen. See if you have already installation you can import the settings here. So I'm clicking just OK here. So I have confirmed and continue this agreement. Do not send any static. So it's loading here. So you, you can select theme which you want to have. Okay, the next one is skip the remaining set the default also. So plugging. If you want to install the build tool, Maven version or whatever you want to have, just select the version this you can click next and then install the light theme voice promoter aws toolkit based upon on that one you can select and install it okay so i'm skipping that the community version is 2019.3 is the version is there okay so you can click on create a new project here is there and on the down one is you can see the configuration is also is there so click on Chrome, Kotlin, whatever you see here, you can click on next, you click on next, give your project name, finish it. So it will be come up to few minutes. So in this way, this is about the IntelliJ idea. So if you have any problems, you can just comment below to my video and then scanning also my video share my videos and my channels to your friends and relatives thanks for watching my video please subscribe to cloud network channel